is Hank, who had a new smock to help him keep clean at school. This is his house. Hank liked his new smock. It had a big pocket to put things in. He hoped he would find lots of things for his big smock pocket. These are his friends. It's time to go to school. A piece of chalk for the big smock pocket. A spring. Say, that's something for a big smock pocket. On their way, they saw a ball. It belonged to a little girl that Hank knew. She let the children play with her ball. going to keep the little girl's ball? Hank was getting greedy. One of Hank's friends was carrying a can of milk to school on a stick. They passed a thirsty cat. rolled up to the school. The ball fit nicely into his big smock pocket. The more things he saw, the greedier he got. Look at that milk. Hank wanted everything in his big smock pocket, even a glass of milk. One of the children came to look for Hank. All the other children were playing with the toys. Not Hank. He was busy doing something else. But milk isn't meant to go in a big smock pocket. Soon the cat wasn't thirsty anymore. When it was lunchtime, everyone was eating. everyone except Hank. Hank wasn't there. What do you think he was doing? Yes, he was thinking about filling his big smock pocket. All the blocks went in. Then he looked around for more. He had certainly gotten greedy. There were shelves of toys and he wanted them all. He wanted everything in his big smock pocket. He wanted that, too.
A drum. That all right. But how could he fit that into his pocket? Like this. A bird. He wanted that in his big smock pocket, too. But the little bird flew away. And when Hank tried to go outside to chase it, he couldn't get through the door. You can see why. Everyone heard a funny noise and came to see what had caused it. It was Hank. The drum in his big smock pocket was stuck in the doorway. They pulled and they pulled, but they couldn't get him out. One little girl knew what to do. She untied the smock. First, Hank fell out. Then the toys fell out of his big smock pocket. What a lot of toys there were. But they were for everyone to play with, not just Hank. Hank was sorry he had been so greedy. But sometimes, that's how you feel when you're just a little boy with a big pocket in your smock. Oh, yes. He did give back the ball. 